The planet is warming. We are seeing its effect in global temperature rise and extreme weather patterns. Storms, heavy rains, rising sea levels, floods, heat waves, droughts. Long-term changes are not as visible, but affect even more people. In 2006, and for the first time, the Nairobi Climate Conference drew attention to the climate adaptation needs of the poorest developing countries. In 2007, the EU was the first group of countries to adopt the ambitious target to reduce emissions by 20%. Countries most vulnerable to climate change and the EU were on the same page. The Global Climate Change Alliance, GCCA, was born between the EU and those developing countries that are hit the hardest by climate change. The EU provided additional support for climate adaptation and it expected to gain new allies for an ambitious international climate agreement. In 2008, the first four GCCA projects were launched. The GCCA Regional Dialogue resulted in a number of joint declarations on climate change, a common vision that would be reflected in multilateral climate negotiations. In December 2009, the Copenhagen Agreement was signed. All countries agreed to limit global temperature rise below 2 degrees centigrade, and industrial countries pledged a collective commitment for new resources, known as Fast Start Finance. Some EU member states decided to use the GCCA for their Fast Start funding pledge. The largest amount, 31 million euros, came from Ireland. Towards the end of 2011, most least developed countries and small island developing states were involved in GCCA activities. The GCCA strengthened its support to the African, Caribbean and Pacific ACP group of states with the launch of the Intra-ACP GCCA program. An external evaluation in 2014 confirmed that GCCA raised the priority of climate change and facilitated exchanges of good practices. In 2015, the Climate Change Coalition formed by GCCA contributed much to the reaching of the Paris Agreement. The alliance was upgraded to become an EU flagship initiative and GCCA Plus was officially launched. GCCA Plus includes new priorities that support the Paris Agreement, the UN Sustainable Development Goals, SDGs, and the European Consensus on Development. In 2017, the Intra-ACP Global Climate Change Alliance Plus, GCCA Plus program was renewed and GCCA Plus mandate was extended to include more mitigation activities. Ten years after its beginning, the Alliance has become one of the most important climate initiatives for building resilience to climate change in the most vulnerable countries. <laughs>